The Secret of the High Voltage Power Generation of a Stepping Motor, Part 2. Hello, friends. If you haven't watched Part 1, please watch it first. Part 1 focused on measuring the maximum generating voltage of the stepping motor generator. To do that, I fabricated and used a serial rectification circuit like an image to integrate the outputs from 8 channels into 1. While Part 2 focuses on the actual operation of the electrical device at full current using rectification circuit changes and capacitors. In this project, unlike previous projects, a rectifier circuit was fabricated to operate in the 100 volt range by lowering the voltage to increase the current to the maximum. In order to perform this task, a parallel rectification circuit was fabricated and the concept was expressed with a battery to help you understand. In this case, lowering the voltage will increase the current to the maximum, which will then amplify up to eight times due to the low current in this stepping motor. In addition, I decided to use large capacity capacitors to maximize the output of the stepping motor. Therefore, a new rectifier board was built and two large capacitors were prepared to stabilize the voltage. The new rectifier board installed in same location. An aluminum part was made to accommodate two capacitors. Now it's time to check the output current and voltage of the system. The motor used here is the motor used in my other YouTube videos, and we can see it running easily. Motor acceleration is very good. and the current generated is more than expected. This is a no load voltage output test to find the maximum voltage of the system. I expected the output voltage of this device to be near 100 volts, but it's easily over 100 volts now. I'm going to stop it near 193 volts. The voltage keeps increasing slowly, but I'm going to stop at 193 volts.
All parts were installed, including two capacitors and the DC motor. All right, let's start testing this system. This motor drives very well by the stepping motor's output. Currently, the motor is driven by the power of the stepping motor, so the voltage reaches about 93 volts, and the LED light is easily turned on. Great, the output voltage has reached about 93 volts, so I turned it off now. Let's start the last one more test. This is an LED light test. The total energy consumption for the six lights is 97 watts. I wait until it's 120 volts. All right. There's no problem turning on six light bulbs. It has been confirmed that the modified system works as I intended. The power generation test of the stepping motor has been completed. Please like and subscribe my channel. Thank you for your watching.